Mexico City has an excellent mass transit system. Part of it is the Metro Bus, which ties in with the Metro Underground system. So we're about to take the Metro Bus so you can see how it works and how efficient it is. Operating since 2005, the Metro Bus is a fast and cheap way to get around Mexico City. It's considered a BRT or bus rapid transit system designed to be more reliable and carry more people than a normal bus. Most of the routes operate on dedicated lanes, which means the buses are often faster than cars. Some 1.8 million people ride the bus every day, at least during normal times. The system now has seven lines. The fleet has 660 vehicles and there are four types of models. The 130 passenger double-decker buses that run along Paseo de la Reforma Boulevard are impressive, but the most common type of bus has either two or three articulated attached cars. To show you how to ride, we'll follow the line along Avenida Insurgentes, one of the busiest streets. Step one is to buy a Metro card. The card costs about 15 pesos, about 73 cents US. Just follow the on-screen instructions to buy a card or add value, and you can pay in cash. Each ride costs just 6 pesos, that's about 29 cents. Next, proceed to the turnstile and press the card to the screen to enter the platform. Metro bus stations are clean and modern and you don't need to walk much to get to the bus. You can check directions and routes on the station maps, and also the bus arrival times on the video monitors. Also be sure to check the signs above boarding doors to make sure you're going in the right direction. Once your bus arrives, stand back and get ready to board. But be careful, some doors are only for women, children, and people with disabilities. On board the bus, pink seats in front are reserved for women only. The gray seats are for everyone and you'll find plenty on these giant buses. Remember that during the pandemic you must wear a face mask, and if you can, you should probably avoid rush hours when it can be crowded. Once the bus arrives at your stop, simply grab your belongings and disembark. There are signs to indicate where the exits are, and you don't need to present the Metro card to get out of the station. Thanks for joining Angel and me on our Metro bus excursion. Please like, share, and subscribe to my channel, and also check out my travel blog, latinflyer.com.